I'm what you'd call a gullible gamer. I fall for this marketing ploy every time. Not sure if this is because of what John Rogers, writer of Jackie Chan's adventures, referred to as competence porn. Watching supposed experts come together, banter, and get shit done. Alright, let me try to get that tank off you. Or maybe it's a kind of power fantasy. Getting oh, to be part of a well-oiled machine that sweeps through the lobbies. Treating other players like extras in a John Wick movie. There's just one problem with that. There's a bunch more coming in. Okay, I'll get this round. My friends and I we're idiots. No, Plumber killed me. I'm dead. Did I just hear you got detained by Plumber? This is, first. this is my issue. Our terrible, terrible teamwork. If we're not diving face first into losing gunfights and killing each other, helping to Sherpa the new recruits through their own starting tasks. Plumber does not flex. What do you it's mean I don't flex? Here, boys. All right. Hot dog, Shit. if you will. Where'd you guys go now? Uh, pills. Ahead of you. Turn right. Turn forward. Now turn left. Left more. Ah, uh, go straight. Yeah, <laughs> the right more. Yeah. yeah, here we go. <laughs> I don't mind these kinds of sessions. I die a whole lot less when I'm taking the new blood out for Waxies and making sure they get fed. Yeah, I'm with you. Task wise. Yep, yep. The end result tends to be the same. Got the note. Alright. Um. Got it. They make okay. slow progress right on bread and butter quests, and I stay hard stuck on Punisher Part 3, waiting for them to catch up. Keep going. Were you behind me, Plumber? Oh, you went back this way. You can't be too hard on them. I mean, this is Plumber's third wipe, at least, but gaming is new, and we all had to start somewhere. But there's a couple of ways they can get on my nerves. Not that I'd ever let it show, aside from here and now. One, being the kind of guy who's always somehow short when it comes time to split the bill. Thanks, Cameron. You're my friend. You're a hero. And a real human being. <laughs> and two, questions. The never-ending questions. Um, I'm injured. What do I need to do? I'm all, like, red. So, how do you know what bandages to apply for which wounds? How do you, uh, get your insured weapons back and all that? What is the blur? What is post-FX? Do you have to, uh, push to talk in order to, like, talk in-game or no? Yeah. It's V. It's what? V. B. Okay. 
Is there a way to like, uh, there's not like a FOV slider or anything, right? I probably can't change my settings right now, huh? I got no idea where extract is. How do you pull up your, uh, compass? Why can't I go prone? Do I need to go back there and get it? How do go. you see how much money do you have? How do you turn your flashlight on? How do you rotate stuff? How do you open up this door? Should I take this respirator or no? Oh man, where's the extract? I'm sorry. How do you uh, swap backpacks? How do you drop it? If I drop something on the ground, I can't pick it back up, right? How do I drop it to you? And where are you? Uh, how do I drop it for you now? I'm sorry. What my friends are good for is a fun time. <laughs> what I lose in gear, I make up for in being a terrible person in the company of other terrible people. I still have five left. <laughs> You're sweet if you get stuck on me. What the f Oh my god! <laughs> I thought that was a smoke grenade when I was watching. I'm hurt. <laughs> it fell right on me. I'm gonna die up here. I don't even know what direction I'm supposed <laughs> to be looking anymore. Now, before you judge us too harshly, you have to realize Nah, I've got nothing. There's no excuse for this. We're just assholes. No! <laughs> oh, what? Okay. Wait, wait. We should How? Play game. try to throw one, but like. <laughs> is... Oh, okay, I gotta go. This way. Here's someone, here's There's someone, someone here. Someone's here. I can't see. <laughs> someone open the door. Hello! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the party! <laughs> we even tend to make sure that no one in our group lives without our sin. It's a bit like a gang, except initiation is just making sure that someone who works a 9 to 5 gets as little as possible out of their limited free time. Oh, what are we doing? Uh, whiskey, you've got to, um, the only bush left is the one in the middle of all the flags. Are we actually just camping in our golf? What we're doing is we're having a guy <laughs> hang out with select fights. We, we are defending Emmer. You're making sure that it is this our is attraction point goal. Oh, it's God. It's What's that? Play the game. But as fun as being the pettiest villain in someone else's life can be, this is all just a pleasant distraction. The cloud kind of looks like a dick with a butt. Graceful little picnic in the sun. Now it's time for me to get to work. It's not even that Punisher Part 3 is difficult. It's just 25 scab kills on customs using an AKS-74U. But it is time consuming, especially at this point in Wipe. Everyone's on the same quests, roaming around customs, vacuuming up customs kills. And bringing people along, those are just more players to take those scab kills you need. So, on my own, with my trusty gun in hand, getting things done is up to me, and me alone. Right, my process. Sneak my way across the map, stop to farm scabs as I go, repeat. It can get a little boring, but I've found a way to breathe life into the process. Because while all those E3 demos may star teams of virtual tactical operators flexing their vocal range, there's one way to feel tactical without competent friends. I call it... The Sam Fisher Method. There's nothing like using gadgets to make your cowardice look cool. Operating in the shadows, killing my foes before they can even recognize I'm there, let alone fire back, that may seem like an unfair way to play the game. And 
That's what I'm counting on. It's one of my favorite ways to get tasks done while I'm playing solo. I'll just scav run my way through the in-game day and time my PMC raids for the night like a tactical vampire. What the? While the night may still have its share of PvP hungry players looking to put an end to my tasking, and my all consuming passion of unlocking cooler looking pants before the next wipe. Their overconfidence is a little easier to deal with when they're sprint Wing blind. And even with all these practical benefits in mind, night raids just feel really, really cool. So, let's get Punisher Part 3 finished in style. I just need to scout out RUAF and scoot my way across the river into construction. Pretty safe trip, if you play it slow and move at just the right time. I'm hurt! They got me real bad. didn't exactly go as planned. I'm just gonna recuperate and pick up from where I left off. This isn't a terrible position to be in. It's like sitting in a fork in the river deciding, do I go left or right? Except instead of fish, the river is filled with a lot of very angry Russian dudes and some lost Americans, all armed and dangerous, of course. That's not good, but hey, maybe they're just passing by. But before I go, now that I'm mostly patched up, I need to load up because there won't be much point to this raid if I'm not snatching up scab kills like the goriest easter egg hunt ever. Nothing like a roadside picnic. Now, if only there was a game like this set in the Stalker universe, or something with some SCP vibes, I'd be all over that. Okay, feelings mutual, bud. I can't tell if the sound is working really well, or just really, really bad.
No one here. I'm off. Me and them? Oh, we're just gonna agree to pretend that never happened and get back on track. That should be 21. Just four more to go. No snipers. Probably should have checked that earlier. I think my next stop is the hill by dorms. Resupply. To fix them where all the fish are. Looking both ways. Yeah, I don't know about this, but it seems pretty safe to me. I should be able to get back on track from here. I've heard some shots that weren't me, but I don't think that player I shot at is tracking me down, so he's holding up his end of the bargain pretty well. A second. Pretty bold for a player scav with no flashlight. Hello? I'll just say it was the wind, but I'm surprised that PMC hasn't tried hunting me down yet. Definitely someone here with me. Вроде никого. Seriously? This is more scavs than I've seen the last three raids combined. Another player scav. I better finish them off before this becomes a problem. they stop shooting me. There's no way I'm getting a headshot on a shadow. Let's get a bit closer and hope the player's gap hasn't doubled back at all. Just one more to go. I'm pretty sure I only winged the other guy. Now, where do you run off to? I figured he'd lie in wait. That, or he's halfway across the map by now. I mean, I'd probably run too. This feels kind of wrong. Silence. That could have gone a whole lot worse. Things didn't exactly go according to plan in the end, but the space between me and Extract is pretty much a dead zone at this time of raid. I think I'm just gonna head out.
Dudes, I'm done. I don't need any more. Say hello to my little friend. Oh. There's no way I'm actually alive after that. I'm just one limb away from being a human potato right now. <coughs> this, this is salvageable. I just need to find somewhere to surgery. Great. More player scabs and a frame drop. Awesome. Wow. May as well just check what he's got, and then I can get the hell out of here. Yeah, I, I think that's my cue to leave. Chill, I heard you the first time. Just, how dark is it? Very. Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. А вот тут кореш мой бывал точно. See, now, that's a fancy backpack for a scab. pushing my luck for real this time. Crazy how it can sometimes take a full 45 minutes to get across a map you could just run and bore. But I guess that's kind of the appeal of the chaos. Like how a Sam Fisher style raid could become a balls to the wall fight to survive an endless tide of player scabs, but hey got the job done. And we did it in style. 
mostly. I guess I could have taken my time, gotten some more of that loot out, but honestly, probably would have ended up with five or six more scabs on me. So I'm just gonna make do with what I got and turn in Punisher to Prapor. Wait, when did I kill a Yusek? Son of a 